LSR, liquid silicone rubber, injection molding is a manufacturing process used to produce parts and components made from silicone rubber. It involves injecting liquid silicone rubber into a mold cavity, where it cures and takes the shape of the mold. LSR injection molding is known for its precision, flexibility, and durability, making it suitable for a wide range of applications in industries such as automotive, electronics, healthcare, and consumer products. To implement an LSR injection molding system, you would typically require the following components. Injection molding machine. An injection molding machine specifically designed for LSR processing is required. These machines are equipped with special water-cooled LSR cylinder assemblies, LSR screws, and non-return valves, precision controls to accurately control the injection, temperature, and curing processes. Mold Design and Fabrication A custom mold is created based on the desired shape and specifications of the final product. The mold is typically made from metal such as stainless steel and consists of two halves, an injection side and a cavity side. LSR Material Liquid silicone rubber is a two-part material that consists of a liquid base and a curing agent. The material is formulated to have the desired properties such as flexibility, heat resistance, and chemical resistance. LSR materials come in various grades and durometers, hardness levels, to meet specific application requirements. Material Preparation The LSR material needs to be prepared before injection. This may involve mixing the liquid base and curing agent in the correct ratios and degassing the mixture to remove air bubbles. LSR dosing and mixing peripheral devices are used to fulfill the task of mixing and pumping the material to the machine cylinder assembly. Injection process. The LSR material is injected into the mold cavity using the injection molding machine. The machine controls the temperature and pressure during injection to ensure proper flow and filling of the mold. Curing. After injection, the mold is kept closed for a specific curing time to allow the LSR to solidify and cure to take the shape of the mold. Once the part is sufficiently cured, it can be ejected from the mold. Post-processing The molded parts may require additional post-processing steps such as trimming excess material, surface finishing, or assembly, depending on the specific requirements of the product. Quality control. Throughout the process, quality control measures should be implemented to ensure the final parts meet the required specifications. This may include dimensional checks, visual inspections, and testing for mechanical and physical properties. It's important to note that implementing an LSR injection molding system requires expertise in mold design, material selection, process optimization, and quality control. Working with experienced professionals or partnering with a reputable injection molding service provider can help ensure successful implementation and production of high-quality LSR parts.